to the Mist River healing guide for Eornar, the life binder. Um, honestly, this fight is a bit of a joke, but uh, we're gonna go through it anyways. Uh, for talents, uh, I'm using re Refreshing Jade Wind, but I would prefer to actually be using Chi-Chi, since she jumps around and heals a lot. Uh, for most of the fight, you wanna use your refresh, uh, Renewing Wind, ref Renewing Mist, sorry to uh, have as many hots on people as possible since even if they jump far away from you and you don't know where they are you can keep them uh, nice and healthy so we're just gonna focus on doing that and then doing some uh, dps to the ads so that they die even faster than normal um, since the faster the ads die the less we have to worry about it's just gonna help dps as well and then if we gonna keep our hot up as well and after we go here, there's not much else to do, so we're just gonna follow the group. And since we're getting this uh, thing, we're just gonna move away from the rest of the group. And then, nice and steady, we're gonna move back up. And then we're gonna follow the group up to the top one. Oh, nearly thought I was going to fall down. And we just keep putting out our um, renewing mist as well, so we keep everyone nice alive use your chi burst here because there's a lot of people in front of us manatee and essence font because i'm the only healer here so i'm just gonna keep everyone alive it's not really a problem uh and then we're just gonna avoid the green stuff and keep dpsing while making sure that we actually keep the group alive and don't just turn into a dps so we're gonna use essence font here just to uh, put the hot on everyone because in just a while everyone's gonna go away and be pretty far away from you so you're just gonna jump and then move away from these guys who actually have the dot you can put the dot on them and then you just want to jump to the end here so that everyone is actually here and then we're using the, our artifact ability keep putting our heart up all the time uh, dpsing these down if they didn't have the uh, debuff i would have stunned them you want to use your um one of your stuns as much as possible in this fight to keep the ads from actually reaching where you want them to be um, and then we just stay with the group basically here these guys are gonna, going to get the dots we just move away from them and then we heal them up afterwards put the hot on everyone we're gonna get some bats and we're just gonna ignore them because we actually want to stay with the group and we don't really want to go super ham on them uh, and then I'm going to go up here, because we have some classes who are going to uh, dot these bats, and I'm just going to heal them up a bit so that they don't die, just in case. Just going to put the hots on them, um, and then I'm going to just jump down to the group. I'm wasting a lot of mana for um, the enveloping mist, but I'm just going to just to keep them alive so that they can dot them. And I see that this druid is quite low. Uh, but I don't really know where he is right now. So it looks like he's on top of the platform So I'm just gonna try to roll up here and see if I can reach him which I can We just keep them alive. I didn't expect him to drop that low so I just wanted to stay with the group Then we just go down again so we can uh, Heal people up and we can actually DPS some ads So we just kill everything Then we heal everyone up just gonna use revival so we can heal people up fast before they jump away so we won't be able to heal them and then we just jump up to the front entrance where everyone else is we're gonna just keep up with the uh, healing and the dps keep refreshing jade wind so we heal the group while we're actually doing dps so we don't just waste of time and then i'm gonna try to jump in front of them and see if i can stun these ads which i can I'm just gonna keep AoEing them to make sure that everyone can actually. I'm just gonna stun this one. Even though it removes some of the hots. That's one thing you gotta keep in mind with your uh, encapsulate, is it's going to remove all of the dots that are placed on people. Right now, I'm just prioritizing killing this uh, Fellhound before it actually reaches there uh, instead of healing people, because I see they're actually still quite healthy, even though they're getting low. And then we just continue killing the, all the ads. That should just basically be it. Then we're getting more bats. And we're just gonna go to the group so that we can actually heal people up again. And we use Essence Font to put uh, hearts on everyone and we move back so we don't stick this uh, 
dot on everyone. And just keep putting all our huts up so that whenever people are leaving us that they are still receiving some uh, healing. And then we just DPS the bats because there's nothing else to do. <clears throat> and then we're getting uh, an app downstairs, but we're taking this one um, upstairs first, so we just can uh, help with killing it fast. So that we actually can go to the other place faster. And then we got time to focus T up, we're just gonna put some more hots on people. And then use Essence Fund here, since we're actually leaving again soon. But then a lot of people are actually dipping low. Um, so I think I'm actually going to go downstairs, because there's some uh, stuff down here. And then we're just gonna use Essence Fund to just place some huts on these guys, and then we're actually gonna jump over here. And then move so we can jump up this platform. We actually want to get to the top of the stairs, because there are some people up there who also need some healing. I'm just going to pop our thing on him to heal him. And that's it. Pretty easy, just spam your essence fund for hot when people are leaving, and you'll be fine. 